Hello, how you doing? Um, update video for today. I know it's been a while since I published one. I've been working on uh, a lot of different projects. Uh, still all scout related. Maybe I need to find something to do. I don't know. Um, so just to get caught up um, over the course of the oh, last several months, I've been looking for some uh, canoes and such for our Boy Scout troop um, so we can do some canoeing. Uh, as we came to the end of season, uh, you know, and here in Michigan, it's well, it's November, so it's it's past canoe season. Uh, but about two months ago, I found a couple canoe libraries that were were uh, reducing some of their inventory. Um, you know, they're as they've told me, more people are getting into kayaking than canoeing, which you know, that makes sense, uh, being that I'm a big kayaker, but. Um, so some of them were reducing some of their canoe inventory just because they didn't need it. Um, so I picked up half a dozen canoes really for my troop for, for cheap. Um, really got uh, a great deal. And I do have to give a, a shout out to, uh, to Riverside, uh, Riverside Canoe up in Honor, Michigan. Um, they really helped me out, hook, hooked me up with, uh, with some canoes uh, for, for my boys. So um, great people to deal with. Um, so if you're ever up in uh, northwestern Michigan there uh, around Honor, I'd say you know, stop in, go see them, and uh, you know, yeah, go 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 for a paddle. Um, they both they do both uh, canoe and, and kayak rentals, uh, but yeah, they help me out. Uh, but so with that, I've been working on a canoe trailer, right? And I got six six canoes so what, what am i going to do with them uh been scouring facebook marketplace you know craigslist such looking for some deals and came across a boat trailer it needs a little, little bit of love but that's not a big deal um that i traded actually a kayak for um gentleman had it, it wasn't going to use it for anything it was starting to get in pretty rough shape um he's got a young child wants to get into kayaking i had a oh child a youth uh, sit on top kayak so we, we made a trade deal it worked out well um actually and this is <laughs> this is the gem uh, i started working on it here some but it's a shorelander trailer single axle um you know roller roller trailer i'll pull the rollers off it and such um you know it, it yeah it looks pretty bad but actually it's not a lot most of that's surface rust um it really doesn't have any what i'll call uh, bad rust it's mostly surface rust. And yesterday, I started working on on the tongue of the, the trailer. Um, so I went through and hit it with a, an abrasive wheel and started primering it. So the black is the rust oleum rust converter. Uh, I'm not supposed to take the rust, change it to a, you know a paintable primer. Um, I've had pretty decent luck with that stuff actually. Uh, the top is just a regular rusty metal primer. Um, but here's an area, I don't know how well you can see it. I mean, I've, I've, I've hit all this with, like I said, just a regular, um, abrasive wheel on, on the angle grinder. Um, just, uh, just one of these guys. Um, yeah, poly, polycarbide, uh, abrasive wheel. So they're pretty cheap, but they do a good job at stripping off paint, stripping off, stripping off rust. Um, the rust converter. Um, here's an area and again. I don't know how well you can see it uh, like this. I hit last night um, That was that looked like You know, it looked like this and Really it really does do a, a pretty decent job as long as it's not horribly rusty for surface rust The stuff actually does pretty good now. I'm gonna take my like I said abrasive wheel and run around um, knock down, you know this this kind of stuff here and uh, And we'll paint her up but overall, I said it's a solid trailer. Uh, it's going to do well. So I'll take the take the rollers off it, get this thing painted up, uh, go get some square tube, and and weld up some uprights and crossbars and get things mounted. So I'll do some updates on that when I get that far. Uh, so the trailer w was a kayak trade uh, for a kayak. I was actually going to get rid of. My son is outgrowing it, so uh, worked out well for both of us. Um, it needs tires, needs tires and wheels. The they're getting pretty rough i mean the 14 inch wheels I, I could clean back up and put new 14 inch tires on they'd be great um actually again a neighbor of mine was he put new new uh tires and wheels on his camper so he had some 15 inch wheels that he was getting rid of um so they were they were free um so these, these are them i again they were you know just white the white spoke style they were pretty rusty 
Um, again, ran around with that wheel and, and a wire wheel. Um, they're not perfect, but you know, as far as flatness of paint, but they're pretty good. You know, and it's like cleaned them up, wiped them down, um, and again, used some of the what Rust Oleum Performance Wheel paint. So, um, shot them with the gunmetal gray or the metallic gray, and um, just put a coat of um, the clear the clear on them. So I hit them hit them again at the clear and throw some valve stems in them and and I picked up some uh oh, what else we have laying around here um some yeah just some just some car tires uh they're 15 inch car tires that are 225s uh, or 215 something like that um they'll they'll for sure fit uh but again pick those up for cheap they're yeah mostly they're not completely bald but uh for as far as this trailer is going to go and for what it's going to do uh they're going to be perfect they'll rot off the thing before before they'd ever wear down. Um, it's just going to be used locally here anyway. So, um, yeah, so real quick, you know, I got a, got a trailer project going. Um, you know, I, I'm, I think I'll have this project all said and done for under 300 bucks. Uh, I really can't imagine I'm going to be much, much higher than that. Um, if I do everything right, I'm really shooting for 200, uh, if I, <laughs> if I, if I can. So, uh, we'll we'll see how it goes. I think it's gonna I think it's gonna work out well for us. Um, so that's my that's my update on my canoe trailer project. So hope everybody's staying safe uh, and find something to do for our corona our corona time here. So thanks so much.